Now that May 4th is here, that means it's also Star Wars Day, so I decided to see how Pem Traffic feels about this cultural holiday. I I don't like um stars. Yeah, what's your opinion on uh, Phantom Menace? Would you say it's the best Star Wars movie ever made? Uh, is it already made? It's been made. Oh yeah, it's great. Is it that May 4th thing? Yes! Uh, I guess I won't be celebrating. Yes, I will. It's a very good day that I have taken deep into my heart. I've been celebrating since I was about roughly three or four years of age. Uh, me and my dad will be dressing up as Chewbacca and the other guy from the, the story. And we just love it. Uh, what's your opinion on uh, Star Wars Day? Will you be celebrating it this year? Is it Star Wars Day? Yes. <laughs> May 4th. No, I'll pass. Uh, would you say Phantom Menace is the best Star Wars movie? No. So, uh, Star Wars Day, what's your opinion? I'm all for it. Yeah, Phantom Menace, best Star Wars movie? No, no. Okay. Star Wars Day, yes or no? <laughs> yes, I love Star Wars. Phantom Menace, best movie, would you say? Probably, yeah. Yeah. I think Harry Potter is my favorite Star Wars character. That's good to know. Star Wars Day, yes or no? Personally, I think there's not enough Jar Jar Banks in the first one. Uh, not enough pod racing either. There should literally just be two scenes, and they should only be Jar Jar Banks and pod racing. Too much, too many lightsaber battles. Just pod racing. That's all we want. I have to agree with Morehead on that one. Spock, he's an OG. He's one of the best guys I've ever met. So, what's your opinion on Star Wars Day? Star Wars. Uh, would you say The Phantom Menace is quite possibly one of the best movies ever made? That's a yes. Uh, would you say Phantom Menace, best Star Wars movie ever made? I don't even know what that is. That's that with Star Wars Day. This has been Alex Wargo reporting for PTV.